As Omar says, I've seen worse. Welcome to Heiner Outdoor Living. We're a team of yardists taking boring, cookie cutter yards and transforming them into one of a kind backyard retreats. Join us as we bring quality, passion, and fun to yards all across the Colorado Front Range, inspiring life outside. So today we are starting a new project um, where we're gonna be adding a 16 foot stream, a little walkway, and we're gonna even finish it out with a little bit of mulch and plants to just have this little destination area in this backyard. So with this project, what we're gonna do is have the basin start here. So this is where our aqua blocks and pump vault are going. And then the stream is gonna kind of hug the fire pit or uh, the patio area and also focus on the main viewing areas towards the house just so they can enjoy it from inside the house just as much as outside. So right here is where the bridge is gonna go. And obviously we'll incorporate some boulders here and then maybe narrow it up here and then widen it out and then have one more falls going into the pond. But right here, the grass gets a little bit wider and this is where we can have a little bit more real estate to kind of create more of a pooling area in the stream uh, just so it's not all narrow. Because one thing that we like to do when we're designing these things is have some wider areas, some more narrow areas and not just something very linear and symmetrical just because that takes away a lot of the natural uh, look to these water features. So here, I'd love to be able to pull it out here a little bit. Still kind of hugging this. And then it's gonna start somewhere here. So we'll burn this up a little bit. This fall is gonna be about 18 inches from ground level just so we can get a fall in here and then some nice pooling areas. And then this one, we don't have too much elevation to work with, so I could see three drops in this one, all said and done, and firming up to where it's not too much to give it that volcano look, but something that is very natural looking. Right now we finally got some of the demo done. We got our clean slate to start uh, installing our basin. For this one we're going to be using five small aqua blocks. What I like to do is get it on the ground first and then outline it. And as I outline it I like to go about six to eight inches wider than the actual thing just to give me some playroom um, for backfilling and everything. So as you can see now I got the spray paint on the ground. It's time to start digging that basin, getting liner in the ground, start rocking and rolling. Let's go! Lunch time here. Um, have some pretty good progress so far. We've got pretty much all of the basin dug in. Almost ready to get the vault and aqua box set in. And then uh, from there, we start excavating the stream and start rocking and rolling. So I'm really hoping to at least get a couple boulders set today um, and really start working up that stream. And then tomorrow, have this water feature done and running.
So this is the third day on this project. You can see we have most of the water feature complete. We are just touching up uh, the bottom basin. As you can see, we got the bridge installed. A couple extra things that we need to do is just kind of finish off some of the wing walls and possibly some uh, boulders to help retain the soil um, and to help naturalize uh, behind the water feature as well. And then just tidy up that basin. And then we need to finish uh, rerouting some of the existing uh, sprinkler heads just so those work properly and then uh, place the plants, get those in the ground and mulch it, put the edging in and we should have this job complete. We just fired up the stream. As you can tell, it's a little bit murky. Give it 24 to 48 hours of it running and all that sediment will settle down. It'll end up being crystal clear. About to wrap up this job. Turned out really awesome. We got the bridge, we got a couple waterfalls. Totally transformed the space for the destination patio. Really gives it that enticing feel to want to actually go out there and enjoy that time living outside. Um, I hope this inspired you. If it did, please like, subscribe, hit that button, get that bell, get notifications. We got some pretty cool projects that we're working on, like the one up in Evergreen, the awesome man-made mountain stream. Please check it out. We'll be back next week. Thank you.